everybody. So, Happy New Year, first of all. And today I'm going to be opening this Champion's Bath collection. This set came out in September, so I didn't open it at that time. I actually kind of wasn't paying attention and didn't see that it was released. And then after that, it was really hard to find. Mainly because of this big Charizard VMAX card in this set that everybody wants. So I have this Elite Trainer box. And this is a double V collection. got the Hatterene V collection too. So both of these have four packs in it and then with the Elite Trainer box it comes to a total of 18 packs so it's gonna be kind of like opening up a half of a booster box. So let me open up these boxes and I'll show you everything that's inside. Okay so let's start with the trainer box. You get some fun goodies in this. You get a bunch of energy cards, a big stack, you could see. You get a little book that tells you how to play the Pokemon card game. All the rules and stuff. get a lot of nice card sleeves with big orange jars hard on them. You get this Charizard V Black Star promo card. A very pretty card. You get a little code for the online TCG, so you guys can have that. You get some of these little dividers, four of them. You get some markers for when you want to play the game. Get some damage counters and a dice. Okay. In the double collection, you get this big double card. And that. You get the smaller one, of course. It's the same as the big one. Also, another online TCG code. You guys can have that one. The Hatterene box, you get another one of these big oversized cards. The smaller version, too. Another online go card. And then, of course, the best part we get some packs. Now, I did notice something a little bit odd in the um, Hatterene box, the are a little bit wrinkly looking. 
thing. Can you see that? It's the difference between this one. This one's really flat. This one over here on the left, really flat. And then these ones are really wrinkly. I know there's been kind of like more talk of packs being resealed. Um, people looking for the fancy Charizard. So hopefully these aren't resealed. It's hard to tell. I guess we'll find out when we open them. This one. Let's see. These two have some strange lines across the top too. And on the bottom of this one. Maybe these were just kind of the end of the print. We'll find out. Just doing a little mixing. But I'll open up these hat terrain cards first just in case. So first pack, like I said this is gonna be 18 packs which is exactly half of a booster box which is what I normally open up. First card is Milo, which is a supporter card. It says to discard up to two cards from your hand and draw two cards for each card you discarded in this way. B drill. Sonia. Search your deck for up to two basic Pokemon or up to two basic energy cards. Reveal them. Put them in your hand, and then shuffle the deck. Weedle. Inkay. Adena. Trumpish. It's probably in the dump somewhere. Kakuna. Reverse Hollow, I say Pokemon Center Lady. Always like these supporter and trainer Reverse Hollows. This one says to heal 60 damage from one of your Pokemon, and it recovers from all special conditions. The rare. Ooh, first rare is a Hollow, and it is a Machamp. He has Macho Revenge and Dynamite Punch, which does 200 damage, but then also does 50 damage to itself. Okay. is kind of on a different side as the booster boxes normally are. Okay. 
first card is Hop, which tells you to draw three cards. We have the Pokemon Center Lady. Suspicious food tin. Mm, do we really want to be cracking that open? But I guess we do because it heals 80 damage from one of your Pokemon that has at least one psychic energy attack. Machop. I really like that art style. Looks like he just busted right through something. Purloin. Starting through the city streets. A little group of scraggies. A full heal. Your active Pokemon. Recovers from all special conditions. Another Hatena. Looks like she's in a little spooky forest. A reverse hollow Scrafty, which is actually a rare card. And he has Corner and Bad Brawl. Looks like he's in some city park. And a rare is an Altaria with Miraculous Charm. Prevent all damage done to this Pokemon by attacks from your opponent's Pokemon V and Pokemon GX. Is this one of those sets where all of the rares are hollows? I haven't seen any openings of it quite yet. All I know is that it's been tough to find. And I know a couple people who, whenever they see it in the store, they buy everything up. They're not selling it or anything, just open up. So, in my opinion, okay, the psychic energy card, and then BD. Attach a basic energy card from your hand to one of your benched Pokemon. Turf Field Stadium. Once during each player's turn, that player may search your deck. For a grass evolution Pokemon, reveal it, put it into their hand, then that player shuffles their deck. Then we have a Rotom phone. Look at the top five cards of your deck, choose one of them, and shuffle the other cards back into your deck. Then put the card you chose on the top of your deck. A Galarian Zigzagoon. Carvana. Looks like Carvana is on a very choppy and tumultuous sea on a very stormy, stormy night. Little groups of scraggies. Swell blue. Hatana. Reverse hollow hop. And the Hollow Scrafty. We just got the reverse hollow of this one, so it's cool to get both of them. Okay, so this is the last pack of the Hat Terrain box. say that these 
backpacks in the hatterine box were very easy to open. Who knows why they're all crinkly. Maybe they were in the heat. It's always possible. First card is Hat Dream. Then we have Appears, which is Search Your Deck for an Energy Card and a Darkness Pokemon. Reveal them and put them into your hand and then shuffle your deck. Sharpedo. Swablu Carvana Aguilarian Lanoon Little Angry Weedle and a pile of dried out leaves Inkay I think this is a reprint Looks familiar Ooh, and reverse hollow energy. These are always so pretty. Let's look at that. Perfect hollow. And then for the rare, we got a Galarian Obstagoon, which has Wicked Ruler. Once during your turn, you may have your opponent discard cards from their hand until they have four cards in their hand. And then Knuckle Impact. During your, next, during your next turn, this Pokemon can't attack, but does 180 damage. Alright, alright, so that was everything in the Hatterene box. Then I think I kind of mixed up the other two, so here's another 14 packs we have to open. <laughs> so let's start with the biggest pile. Water energy. Kabu, shuffle your hand into your deck, then draw four cards. If your active Pokemon is your only Pokemon in play, draw eight cards instead. That's pretty cool. Guess a good safeguard if you only have one active Pokemon out there. Team Yell Grunt. Put an energy attached to one of your opponent's Pokemon into your hand. <laughs> into their hand. And then another little BD. Hatana. Kakuna. There's only 80 cards, I think, in this deck, so you're probably gonna see quite a few doubles. Rockruff. That's a new one, though. Vulpix. Love the vibrancy and the color of Vulpix on this art. Ooh, a classic potion card. Reverse Hollow Arbok. And another Scrafty. So, yes, it looks like every single pack has a rare. So far, we're waiting for our first really good rare card. Energy. 
Kaboom. Team Yell Grunt. Beady. Same thing as the last pack. Swablu. Vulpix. Trumpish. I like that he's winking. I didn't see that in the last card. Didn't notice that. Ooh, a roly coly. That's a new one. Cool Pokemon. Looks like he's spinning and sending out a bunch of pieces of coal. Galarian Zigzagoon. Ooh, a reverse hollow Victini. That's cute. And a Lycan Rock. Jazz Rock Throw and Slashing Strike. During your next turn, this Pokemon can use Slashing Strike. Does 150 damage. Energy is the first one, and another suspicious food tin. Pokemon Center Lady, Victini, a Nicket, Machop, Hacken. Hanging from jungle tree. Swap blue. Inkay. Oh, nice. It's a reverse hollow. Steel energy. Really love the dark colors. You could kind of see me in the reflection there in the camera. And. Oh, how cool. So we got, looks like the last card in the set. It's a secret rare. It's Suspicious Food Tin. Oh, that is so, so, so pretty. These are some of my favorite types of cards. Is the secret rare trainer cards. They're always so well done and beautiful. Just look at that hollow. Just spectacular. Wow, wow, wow. Very, very cool. It's number 80 out of 73, which I think is the last card in the set. Okay. Very, very cool. Put that one in a safe spot. It's some people asking me if I was sleeving up the cards, and yes, I do sleeve them up. Usually I just do it once I'm finished recording. Potion, you know, 120 damage to one of your Pokemon that has at least two energy attached. Sharpedo. Uh, 
a little cocoon on. Roly coly. Trubbish. Potion. Glaring Lanoon. Reverse Hell Hatchery and a uh, Galarian Obstacoon. I think we got this one already. Wicked Ruler. Once during your turn, you may have your opponent discard cards from their hand until they have four cards in their hand. Wow, that's a uh, tense ability if you're able to do that every single turn. Sure, that would be a very viable against that one supporter that lets you have eight cards in their hand. Pokemon Center Lady Turfield Stadium Hop Or even if you have uh, someone who plays this card, you can Wicked Ruler them with your Galarian Obstagoon Hackens Swapalu Inkay Hatana Kakuna Hatana Reverse Hollow and another Scrafty Hollow. These ones are pretty common. Sharpedo Pokemon Center Lady Turfield Stadium Weedle Purloin Ooh, a Pokeball Flip a coin Search your deck for a Pokemon, reveal it, put it in your hand, and then shall throw your deck. Inkay. Galarian Zigzagoon. Looks like there's some really pretty mounds in the background. Yeah, Reverse Hollow, Suspicious Food Tin. And nice. Oh, we got the Dreadnought VMAX. This one is number 15 out of 73. Beautiful full art card. And Drenna has solid shell. This Pokemon takes 30 less damage from attacks after applying weakness and resistance. And G Max Headbutt. Flip a coin. If adds this attack, does 80 more damage. So. More damage than 160. Very 
very cool. Beautiful art of the blue, red, and yellow primary colors of Dreadnought. Alright, we've got some really good cards so far. Very happy with that one in the Seeker Rare. Alright, but we have a few more to open, of course. Great ball. Look at the top seven cards of your deck. You are Mavia, a Pokemon you find there, and put it into your hand. Shuffle the other cards back into your deck. Sonia. Rotom Bike. Galarian Zigzagoon. Scraggy Rockruff I always like how Rockruff's little mean thing makes it look like he is wearing a spiky collar <laughs> Vulpix A glaring Lanoon Reverse Hollow Antenna And a like and rock. Rock Ruff's spiky mane has turned into a full blown mane. There's another really cool set that's coming out. I think I think it's called Shining Fates. And I've already pre ordered my stuff and I think I looked yesterday and everywhere is pretty much sold out already. Pokemon has really blown up again recently. Lipard. Lipard's such a pretty Pokemon. With Limber, this Pokemon can't be paralyzed. And Slashing Claw. Suspicious Food Tin. Pokemon Center Lady. I like the new design for Pokemon Center Lady. Love the puffy sleeves. Gives a very Mm, a little bit of an um, old time look. Weedle. Kakuna. Carvana. Potion. Vulpix. Reverse Hollow Professor's Research. Discard your hand and draw seven cards. This is also a rare card. Very cool. With Professor Magnolia. And an Alcremie V with sugary sprinkles and sweet splash. This one's number 22 out of 73. So. You can heal 30 damage from each of your bench Pokemon with sugary sprinkles. What a cute ability. Creamy is such a cute Pokemon. Like how she has these little strawberry ears too. And Sweet Splash. 
if the defending Pokemon is a basic Pokemon, it can't attack during your opponent's next turn. It's got some little leaves as well as decorations. Looks like El Cream is jumping out of a tree. Team Yell Grunt, Rotom Phone, Milo, Vulpix, Rockruff, Purloin. Oh, Purloin's winking and sticking out her tongue. Galarian Lanoon Sislipede That's a new one Bite and Combustion Reverse Hollow Hatena And an Altaria, another Altaria Stadium. B drill. Really sharp point there. It's shinging in the light. Potion. Vulpix. Ink. Pokeball. Sislipid Reverse Hollow Sharpedo and a Galarian Cursala. Another full art card. This one's number 7173 with Gnawing Aura. As long as this Pokemon is in the active spot, whenever your opponent attaches an energy card from their hand, one of their Pokemon and put three damage counters on that Pokemon. Ooh, a little evil cursing cola coral <laughs> and hollow missile, which does 60 damage. Put three damage counters on your opponent's bench Pokemon in any way you like. Very, very cool. If this ability was, uh, viable on the bench, this card would be insane, but it has to be in the active spot. Such a cute little ghost. Okay. Okay, we have four more First card is Kabu, then a Beatty. Oh, 
capsule for his tapsel. Very realistic looking art. Head tenna. Kakuna. Rakroff. Oh, Rakroff is tracking something. You could see some little footprints in the ground. Vulpix. Potion. Atkins. That was sort of her solo. And a hatterine. Ooh, first hatterine with the hazard sensor. If this Pokemon is in the active spot and is damaged by an attack from your opponent's Pokemon, the attacking Pokemon is now confused. Oh god. So Hatterene has a little uh, parry with even if she's knocked out. And the Life Sucker, which is a little life steal, steals back 30 damage. Okay. Sharpedo, Pokemon Center Lady, Hyper Potion, Full Heal, Roly Coley, Machop, Sislipede, Pokeball, Nice reverse hollow water energy. Beautiful blue foil. And another hatterine. Very nice. Two more packs to go. Rubbish. Roly Coley. Galarian Zigzagoon. Weedle. Purloin. Nice Reverse Hollow Hyper Potion. And. A Scorch, which has Searing Flame, doing 50 damage and burning the enemy. And Heatcrawler, which does 140 damage. Fire Centipede Pokemon. Okay. I usually like to save these ones too because I think they're nice. All right, last pack.
rubbish. Four here. Sizzler bead. Perline. Atkins. A reverse hollow tea meal grunt. And another scent of scorch. <laughs> Alright, you guys. I'm pretty happy with the cards that I got. I think I got four of the ultra rare cards. And of course, one of them being the secret rare. Which is very, very pretty. I'm very excited about it. So, thank you guys for watching. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next Pokemon video. Which is probably going to be couple months when Shining Fates comes out.